Hey guys, this is Donna Dewberry, and I'm going live. I'm the creator of the One Stroke Painting Technique, live right here on YouTube. And I'm hoping that there'll be some people out there that have never saw One Stroke and uh, want to learn something about what I do. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my painter sponges, this is the One Stroke Painter sponges that I created, and we're going to put a little bit of water on this. And so I'm thrilled to be on today. Hope that there's something that I share with you today that will excite you about one show painting. All right. Hello, Miss Pat. I'm just coming on for um, a fun little relaxing painting project. I'm going to put some multi surface paint, guys. This is called multi surface. And I am picking up the painter sponges. And hello, DJ. I have all kinds of Prussian blue. And this is Cayman blue. Yeah, it's a really pretty color. Let me make sure I've got this. Cayman blue. There you go. All right. So I created one stroke painting while I was raising my seven children. My dining room table created. Um, different kinds of strokes, painted on tinware for many years, and all my whole family worked with me with this. And then I started teaching teachers around, people who wanted to paint and become artists around the world, and they have become instructors all around the world with one stroke painting. So I just thought I'd come on. Hello. Hey, Christy. And... Chrissy and Margaret, Susie, hello, hello from South Carolina. And Kiki, I think you're in Australia, right? Ken Kenny, sorry, not Kiki. <laughs> Susie and Greta, hello, hello. Okay, so I'm just putting a quick little background. This paint is wonderful because it's a folk art multi surface, it's satin finish, it has a sealer inside of it. So um, it can go indoor, outdoor on glass, metal, ceramic. And so all I'm doing is putting a little bit of a background here. And I wanted to do some loose painting. I was in the mood to just do something. I took a little nap. As some of you know, I had an accident. So I'm healing. But I just can't stop. I don't know why. I just thought, I don't. I want to create something. Creating makes me feel good. Hello from Kansas. All right, so I'm going to fold these sponges. This is how these sponges come. All right, so you get this size can make brick, like you can sponge brick, and round surfaces like urns that I'm painting. And this is smaller for smaller surfaces. We don't really paint with this unless I'm doing branches. And I push down and slide and do branches on a big tree with that. All right, I'm going to put that in my basin. I'm going to I've got brush basins and palettes and everything that you might want to use to do one stroke painting. All right. Hello. Hello, Susie and Vicki. Uh, those sponges are great. Thank you. I do love them. Um, Bernadette. Hello. Hello. I'm going to be teaching again in class Tuesday. <laughs> All right. So what I wanted to show you is we can take our three quarter inch flat. And these are my one stroke brushes, just to let you know. We're using floating medium instead of water. So there's the floating medium. And I just wanted to paint with y'all today. I hope this is something that you like seeing. And um, we're just going to spend a few minutes putting some color in here. So I'm going to put a little bit, slip, slap, slip, slap, a little bit of medium. And I use that instead of water. And so that we don't get muddy, that we get nice, rich color. All right. I put that base coat in there so it would be faster. Not that you have to be fast when you're creating, but I'm so used to mass production that I'm always creating what's quick and easy to get a look that I want to get. Okay, so can y'all see all that? I put that right on top of the mixed colors that I have there. I use these two colors. All right, so slip, slap, slip, slap. All right, very quick and easy. Thanks for coming on and sharing. Um, the afternoon with me. It's a nice weekend. We've had many things going on this week with the holidays that were here in America. There we go. All right. So now I can then get this 
a pretty Cayman blue in between. All right, so let's put a little bit of white in that. So up here, I can get some really lighter. I'm going to make a field of flowers. And I think you might like this. So tell me what if you tried what set of blue you're using. It's called Cayman Blue. Cayman Blue and Prussian Blue. Okay. So I had Prussian, Cayman, and then Cayman was white. It's Sunday morning over here in Australia. Well, hello, hello, young lady. That's the one place my boys have always said, Mom, go to Australia. I said, someday I would love to. Okay, so I've been to all kinds of countries. When I was in high school and all my friends wanted to travel all kinds of countries, I was just happy to be right here and have a family. And I had five of us, my brothers and sisters. I was the oldest, and I did not want to babysit or have a bunch of kids. So what did I have? Seven. <laughs> I love Prussian blue. Yeah, the this darker is Prussian blue. All right, so here is right in here is the Cayman blue. Okay, see now if you do it quickly while it's all wet, it blends into each other. And I do hydrangeas all the time with that kind of look where we have all these colors and we work them into each other so they make it really pretty. Um, I just have some I just did earlier. Oops. All right, so if you like one stroke painting or want to know about more about one stroke painting, here's some ones I just taught today. And I want, I want you to see all kinds of pretty leaves. So look at this. So hydrangeas, and I let's find today's hydrangea. I was putting some lavender in the leaves, right? We can make it a big art show here. You will be very popular. I would love to do that, sweetie. So let's make a plan. I want you to see all kinds of flowers, but in bright, vivid colors. And it's not even oil paint. So how cool is that? I know I have. Okay. I don't know where it went, but I'll find it later. Just wanted you to see that we made those hydrangeas with three different colors. All right. I think your camera is backwards again. Uh, so this isn't my right hand. <laughs> I flipped it and it said, don't flip it. So we'll see. All right. You're lefty. Okay. Let's be a righty. So I just did that for all you lefties to see how to do it easily. <laughs> uh, will you teach the bulb poppy behind you in the photos? Yeah, I, I have taught that. It's on Patreon. You can go join my Patreon for a month and take for $20 and take all the lessons right there and finish that painting, which is normally a more expensive class, but you can do it by being a Patriot on Patreon. So it, now the brush is right. Thank you. So it is P-A-T-R-E-O-N, Patreon with Mark and Donna Dewberry. And you can do that oversized painting with me. All right. And I go slow. It's called a growth class. And it takes, I think it's about three classes we did. So check it out. All right. So you can become a member of One Stroke Advantage. You can become a member of Patreon. One Stroke Advantage is right here. Okay. Y'all want to see what else I'm going to paint now? I have some, I've got my double loader. And we put floating medium in the middle. And if you want to take a break while you're painting, you can take and cover it with the lid that comes with it and you dampen the sponge, put it in there and put it on there. And it lasts like at least 30 days. How cool is that? As long as you snap that on really good. All right. So now I want to come in here and I'm going to get classic green and sap green. See how I split it in the double loader. This can't helps you guys um, not get muddy. All right. And so it kind of controls you a little bit. There's some white. Uh, it is available on Amazon. Yeah, it's on Amazon, but I'd rather you buy it from me. <laughs> and that is at onestroke.com. And you're going straight to me instead of to through manufacturers or other people that are selling it. 
So be sure to check out my site and then we have good prices there too. And you will know, and we even sell to other countries because there's so many people, even the paint company that doesn't sell to other countries, but we do, you still have to pay. We do the USPS and we do some uh, bases too, military bases. So you get that discount. There you go. All right. So now these are going to be the stems. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Susie. Uh, so, yeah, we're just trying to, I'm on here promoting my onestroke.com site myself. And so I appreciate your support. All right. And let me show you guys. Here is the brushes. These are the 10-piece brush set. These are less than $20. And you get all these brushes that I use the most. All right. So when I say we've got all the flat brushes from two to three quarter, two scruffy brushes that are natural hairs. These are all synthetic nylon, two liners. And I created all these Donna Dubry brushes. All right. And so they come in my new one stroke packaging with my roses on it. And so we have that on our site. Then we have this matching sponge set on one stroke on my site. And guess what I have? I want to share with you all that I have my um, signature brushes. And so you can see all the specialty brushes I created all have my flower roses on it. And then all the rest of the brushes. So this is the brushes I just showed you were the 10 most used brushes. And these are the 13 most used brushes that I have. All right. And actually, um, right here is a 10 piece set. And this is, that's really good for beginners. But if you want the best high quality brushes that I've ever had, these are pro brushes and they're my signature brushes. So check them out. They're all on my website. And if you join my Facebook group, Donna Dewberry's official one stroke group, guess what? You get two sales a week that where you can get my product for great prices. So just let you know all the new stuff that's coming out, everything that we're doing, get ready for a convention that's happening in July on the 21st, I think it is. And all right. So these are going to be the stems for some of our, um, some of the different flowers that I'm going to be painting. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up, oh, this is what I have to share with you. Where is the neon? I love neon paint. I have all kinds of neons and I'm going to use some neon today. So here's neon blue, pink, purple, orange. So I listen, when I would contact, when you contact our studio or offices, uh, my daughter Amanda will take an order and say, I want all the neons, but they're right there on my website too. And if you're One Stroke Advantage members, you get 20% off everything. YouTube, One Stroke Advantage, so one of the advantages is every month you get uh, a 20% coupon for all you want to buy during the month. Right? So these are the neon colors. So now let's take and pick up some neon blue. All right. So when I'm painting with this neon blue, it's, you might not see it right now, but as it dries, it gives you this killer, just popping color. Um, thank you. I'm glad you like my brushes. All right. So look, I am stroking downward and the neon's going to show really good because it's on the dark blue. All right. I'm going to put some green also, but right now I am just coming in here and putting a few of these. Now this looks best when it dries. So when I put the thumbnail up for this live, do you like lives? I don't know. I was just, I wanted to come on today and share with you another fun live where you can um, do some pretty projects that you might not have thought about. Uh, thank you for liking my brushes. I appreciate that, guys. All right. So I'm going to take a 16 flat. All right. And this brush, you can buy singly a 16 flat. All right. So now look what happens. Let's put a little bit of citrus green in here. So I, I have a few green. All right. There we go. 
I have a few greens, classic green, sap green. This is citrus green, bright, bright, bright. All right. And we even, it, what you can do is you can even get my most used colors. There's paint sets that make it real easy. You don't have to know exactly. It's the ones that I use the most. Okay. And so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pick up some of that neon blue with citrus. Or I might come and put some of it on later. Let's get a little sap. All right. So sap and citrus. And then I split it. I Like I came here and I split it. But then I come right here and I work it in. Okay. So let's pick up a little bit more sap. All right. And I've got some of these that are going to be baby uh, Queen Anne's Lace. So I have a couple of different heights here. I'm going to put some along here. See, I'm making an upside down umbrella. One of the things I do with one stroke painting is I use my chisel edge a lot or an angle brush or a liner brush. But I use this brush a lot because you can do amazing quick projects and it holds a lot of paint. And I might have to go over each one of these strokes multiple times with a liner. But you can see how quick this happens when I'm using the chisel of the brush. So look, I can pull up or I can pull down. See the multiple little streaks I put in there? All right. Now I'm going to go to each one of these stems and put, I'm going to do thistles. Okay. And see, I want it really nice and bright. Let's put some all in here. So I've got four of, the, four of these. I think I need five to have a good number. And then I'm going to come right here. So I can make one up in the middle of here. Okay. And then I can pull a stem. So look, you want to come right here at the base right here of all of these and look at that are you in the mood to learn something new today have you ever wanted to be able to paint have you ever wanted to make some extra money doing uh, your hobby i need i need people that want to get certified to be in my instructors around the world everywhere we have people asking for do you have a teacher in our area Hi, Eddie. Um, inner girl. Hello, hello. Love angle brushes. Me too. I, I love the citrus green. It's really nice and pops. Yes, 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 yes. I would love for y'all to be teachers. Contact us on one stroke. No, it's on, um, yeah, one stroke.com. Oh, I'm losing it. One stroke.com. I am thrilled. To be just sharing some pretty painting with y'all today. Something that you can, this is all for beginners. Quick, quick and easy. All right. So I want you to see, I have these little steps that make all these strokes possible. This is all with the chisel of the brush. All right. But I have liner brushes. I have other brushes for you to use. All right. So these are the ones I had, I was sharing with you guys. Here's the 10 most used brushes right there. They're beginner, starter, and wonderful loving brushes. Just discovered your channel. I'm in love with your art. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So look, sponge painters make your life so much so wonderful. So if you're just coming on, you need to watch it again later from the beginning. So you see all this fun, this fun I'm creating and how quick and easy I create it. So look, I am going to take and do these little leaves right here. All right, and I can add some of those later, but I'm just showing you that this palette makes it easy for you to be able to paint and load your brush. Loading is the most important thing with my technique. It's called one stroke painting, and I teach you how to blend, shade, and highlight in every stroke you make. I have free lessons, and I have Facebook Live, I mean, YouTube Lives, I have YouTube lessons. Every Wednesday and Friday, I have 600 lessons on. There's lots for you to learn, and it, I make it quick and easy for you. 
And you love the live lessons. Thank you, Chris, Christy. Uh, I have so many Chris, Christy, Chris's in my life. <laughs> All right. So now I'm going to pick up, let's pick up some purple and some, this is violet pansy and neon purple. All right. So I'm going to come in here and put some of these in. Okay. That's also just chisel edges. All right. Now what makes it really nice is I can pick up some of this cobalt and put some of that. But look, I can grab just a little bit of white and make this really pretty. You see the thistle? So look, neon and violet pansy. Okay, let's come up really high. Oops, I'm in the way. All right, so that's just those two colors. I can get neon in there. Let's pick up some big neon. There you go. All right. Now I can pick up some pink neon. Let's put a little pink in this one. Isn't that pretty with that background? And then we'll get a little bit of white. All right. And if I do that, then I can put some blue in here. See the blue? All right. So are you liking the colors? All right, so I'm going to pick up the purple and neon again. Chisel this like this is all that chisel so far. Everything's chisel. All right, I've chiseled the leaves. I chisel. Oh no, I laid this flat. So I do have lots of fun technique to show you. And every week I give you a practice stroke. If you haven't watched those yet, the practice strokes are right here on my channel free. And what I do is I teach you every element about one stroke painting, how to start, how to use the tools, how to load every brush. All these fun techniques are right here for you. So it's like a course and they're tutorials that you take one at a time and you do homework until you feel comfortable with it. And you can look up any leaf or flower like what I'm showing you right now. You can go learn the chisel edge strokes. How about that? And then feel comfortable coming and doing this. This one, I think, is very easy. You can do it with me. You can do it after I'm off. You take this chisel. You have to have good chisels, good flat brushes to be able to do what we're doing. I, do, I love doing your self art. That was fun, wasn't it? All right. So, so far, we got yummy colors. All right. So, <clears throat> So are you glad that we're on today? Let's see some thumbs up because that tells YouTube that you are happy with me and you want to see more because when y'all do that, I don't know if you've seen any of my shorts, but the shorts have grown my site. So we have 1,500 new members this month. So subscribers. So please go check out my shorts. My grandson, my grandson helps make me those go up for me. And all kinds of fun looks on there and it inspires you to come paint with me more all right aren't those kind of fun now look at the difference when i start adding the pretty color and and here's one that only has the base basic basic strokes to start with all right do i have them all done i'm just not through with this one we're going to put some neon purple we're going to put some neon pink this isn't black light. This is neon. Okay. And I have to tell you, I'll do a lake, beautiful lake scene with flowers and all kinds of fun water and everything. And then I will come back with neon and touch some of these flowers and this night and day. It just blows me away how pretty that turns out. Uh, can y'all see that? We're putting that cobalt blue right there cobalt blues in here right there okay so now i can come back and even make this more jazzy all right hello lynn this would be a great painting party absolutely because it's fun 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 thumbs up you got to go up there somehow they say you start you stop um the text for a minute and you go and hit thumbs up you click it i don't know i don't know how to do it but thank you for being on i appreciate you guys all right so look we're going to come in here 
and put some citrus um, bottoms, little strokes, same strokes I did above, but these are going to be like the base to the thistle. This is a quick and easy thistle, not a heavy detailed thistle. And this is something that if you would love to come do projects like this and be teachers for us, come check it out. You can check out How Do I Become a Teacher on right on our onestroke.com, okay? Bernadette, please hit the the like button for Donna. Thank you. It's up, oh, we got 38 now. Thank you. Thumbs up, thumbs up. All right. And so now we're going to take one of those fun brushes that I was telling you about, and that is a scruffy brush. All right. So here's a medium scruffy, scruffy brush. I have quarter inch. Hello, Vicky. Hello, guys. All right. So we are going to take and pounce. Let's get this white. This was my base coating plate. Okay. So this, this, you never wet it. All the other brushes I wet before I do it. This one is just tapping. Okay. So look at what happens here. Uh, it's thick paint. You're going to pounce it so you can kind of see through it also. Now, one of the things I do is put some citrus. All right. So I could pounce citrus and then white. All right. So look what happens to this. All right. This is Queen Anne's Lace. Okay. And see, it's got citrus and white in it. Hello, Susie. I was certified about 20 years ago. I have so much has changed. I know. And people, I am not good, but thumbs up. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Is that good for sunflowers too, Donna? Yeah, I use this brush for the center of the sunflower, my scruffy brush. So this is one of my specialty ones. I have them in both of my sets. And my one set, my green standard set, I have a small scruffy and a big scruffy. And this is the middle scruffy. All right. So all of these, everything that you need to know and how to get around and do things that are right on our website. So I just like to share onestroke.com all spelled out. And we have amazing tools and supplies and all kinds of product that I'm telling you will make your world happy if you want to learn how to paint. All right. So, and I also teach you design as we go, but you don't have to know all that. Uh, you're going to learn it as I teach my lessons. And so for $9.95, you can join my membership. $9.95 a month gives you four lessons, usually once one for every week of the month. And the other thing that you get is a 20% off coupon every month for being a member to buy anything you want on my website. So you can go sign up now and get the coupon right now before you go buy brushes and all and try out my site right here on YouTube. All right. So look, that's, that's an even number. So I had to, I put another one down here. Okay. Are y'all liking it? All right. Thank you for being on with me today. It makes me happy to come on and share lots of fun strokes and how we do it we want one in the background we want this one on front see it's a little bit heavier white so it looks like it's on front this is in front this is um, a brush i also used on friday's um oh friday's practice strokes the small my first time watching i have a few brushes and books you are awesome thank you you're in lower Michigan. Well, my assistant just moved here from Michigan uh, about four years ago to take care of me. <laughs> she tries to organize me. I make it really hard. All right. So just look at that. It's simple, clean. I came on 29 minutes ago and did the whole thing in front of you. So let me tell you, when you can take a technique and do it simple and fast and people I just, they need this. It gives them inspiration to keep going during high, hard times. Um, and if you become one of my teachers, you will have the support of all kinds 
of how to's that I share. All kinds of teachers out there that can help you hold your hand and do the strokes with you. I love that um, COVID gave me this whole platform to use to get out there and touch you guys. That's all neon that I'm going over with right now. Uh, may I ask, please, how much a painting like this would sell for? Okay, so if you were selling these, um, what I tell people is to charge. Um, you decide how much you want to make an hour. And if I was doing, um, I've had many people that sell this that they do really quick and they do three or four at the same time because it makes it even faster for $45 to $55. It's a really quick, fun little project. But we do greeting cards where you can get $5.99 each for them. There's all kinds of ways to do this and have fun while you're doing it. But you make a lot of money by teaching. So that's just think you can teach um, eight to 10 people that are going to each pay $35 to $45 to take the class from you. And this is what you'll be teaching. So if you ever thought about that, we teach kids class, adults classes. We have fun creating and inspiring other people. All right. So Lacey, I can never get mine that Lacey. Well, so if you saw me do this and you've been around for a while, Miss Jeannie, I'm tapping the dry brush. Hear that? And then when you go on, you are not swishing it but you're barely touching it but you keep going over that while you're touching it okay so that's the magic of it is that you don't pounce really heavy over and over on the queen anne's lace you want that light airy fluffy look all right so that's the only brush when it goes into water i'm pouncing it straight up and down because it's natural hairs i pinch this feral part right here i pinch this I fluff it and put it back up ready to use again because you can't use this wet, okay? That's my scruffy brush. I created those just for what we're doing right now. All right, so I want to do a, a dragonfly, okay? So I'm going to, I have dragonfly glaze, which is iridescent sparkle. Let me see. I think I have that right here. All of this is on my website. See all this? All kinds of fun product that you can um, learn how to use and create. Now, where did I say? Oh, here's the neon blue. So I'm going to pick up a touch of white, neon blue, and pick up medium. Can you see that? All right. All right. Now, you can't see that very well, but you will. All right. Let's see. Here's the top wing. All right, and here's another wing on this side. I just try to get it the same length. All right, I forgot this is like the color in the background, so that's not exactly what you want to do. Okay, let's get it white. Okay, and here's a short one over here. Now, we're going to let that dry. Uh... You just read my mind, <laughs> putting a dragonfly. Okay, so I'm going to come in here with sap. And, oh, I, I was going to have it come down, but now I'm going to have it go away. All right, so I'm doing the little body parts. And then I'm going to pull that dragonfly tail. All right. Now I can come right here and do... Two antennas. I know they don't have antennas, but I'm doing a whimsical one, okay? Then I can come right down here in his body and put that knee on, okay? And have it go right down the back. Now, I'm going to take, let's see what we're going to use, a little bit of stronger white, all right? Look at this. We're going to come around and come around and let's do some little white lines on here. And we're going to, I've got a little thing. I'm going to wet my brush 
with a clean, wet brush, you can come here and clean off anything you don't like. All right. Can we see lines on there? We got some lines. All right. So I'm going to come here. And we're going to do this. And then we're going to put Dragonfly Glaze. So you're going to want to wait to see what that looks like. Because it's really amazing. I wanted to share with y'all today that we wanted to tell you about my lessons that are right here on YouTube. I'm Donna Dewberry, the creator of the One Stroke Painting Technique. And I did that while I was raising my seven children. And now I've traveled all over the world teaching people how to paint. And now we have YouTube, which makes it wonderful. My favorite to use. Well, thank you, Shauna. All right. So now this is what I'm going to do. Because you're not going to believe what it turns out like. So one of the things that we can come up with, I'm going to put this dragonfly glaze now, all right, is that we can come in here and make these pop even more. Okay, so here's my glaze. Now it looks white. All right, so let's pick a brush up here. All right, it's a glaze and it sparkles just like dragonfly wings do. Okay, so... This will dry while I'm painting. Oops, oops, oops. Where did I get that green from? Oh, I touched the center. Okay, so. Now I can show you in a little bit about the glaze. And you can put this also in other objects in your painting. You like the different shades of blue? It's kind of nice, huh? So I don't know if you can see, but it's got glitter all in it. Not yet. When it dries, you'll see. Okay, so now let's look at what it looks like to come in here with some purple. I'm going to put some purple in. This is neon purple. All right. Neon purple's coming in all along there and giving you some yummy looks. All right. I went right over the blue because the blue isn't showing up quite as well because it's got so much blue in the background. So I think that you're going to see this purple and be wild by it. Lots of people love purple. All right. So is it getting there yet? No. So I can also, after we get this iridescent dragonfly, we can take some purple along there. Let's get a little bit more. All right. Also, let me show you what happens. I can come right in here and pick up some dark blue with floating medium. Are you having a good time yet? Floating medium, Prussian blue, and we're going to make this shadow. Like you can see the dragonfly shadowing. So we're going to come right under these wings. Okay. And it's going to give, it's going to lift it off your project and make it look like it's flying above. All right. And then I can come right along here. Let me get some more blue. So we're going to come right along here and lift it up you see how it looks like it's lifted up off your piece okay so go check out the paint kits the brushes all the fun tools like the double loader and all kinds of lessons and education if you want to become a teacher we have all kinds of ways for that to be possible you can do it online we have teachers all over the world that will teach it to you or you can come, you can come to Florida where I live. There's all kinds of places I can, we do it online or in person. 
and it's less expensive sometimes online because you don't have to travel. But I've just had people just fly in because they wanted to meet me at least once and paint with me. So that was fun because I'm in Florida. That's a great place to come, right? Okay. So can you see how by putting a little bit of dark blue under those, we're going to get a great look here. So um, one of the things you can also do in the sky is I'm going to come in here with my brush. Let's get my liner brush. And I can come and make some little lines of shiny iridescent, which we'll show you where the dragonfly came from, right? We can have it coming from over here and it came around. Anything that you want to add to it, we have all, we have treasure golds, we have glitter, glitterific, and we have this wonderful paint that is, this is Dragonfly Glaze, and it's going to just pop your projects. We paint on fabric, glass, canvas, ceramic, wood. Lots of wonderful projects, right? All right, so I'm going to sign it and post it. And thank you so much for being on with me. I hope that I, I um, taught a stroke study today. I want you to know that you can do it. I love to motivate you to do something that you've always wanted to do. I, with my seven children, figured out how I could work at my dining room table and buy the extra things and help our income in our home. And I can very easily show you how to make $100 a week, $400 a month, very simply doing quick and easy teaching like this one. And we teach you how to make it a business, how to turn it into something that improves your life. And find your talents that God blessed you with because he blesses us all with talents. My talent sometimes is more talking than anything else. But um, you guys bless me by coming on and watching and sharing with everybody else that you know how much you love painting. So come um, try it out. See what we're doing. Every week I come on with more. I'm hoping that you can see the iridescent. All the wings are iridescent just like this is here. So neon, dragonfly glaze, and more. Thank you so much, guys. Um, uh, we did this in 30 minutes. So think about that. I could use some motivation if you can bottle that for me. I'll send the check. <laughs> All righty, Edie. I have to tell you, on our Patreon, Mark and I every week come on and share with you how is the, the Mark and Donna Dewberry Patreon channel. is the painting world of Mark and Donna Dewberry. We teach you and motivate you spiritually and, and other with other ways of how to make this uh, prosper for you, how to make it be something that helps you through hard times. And we've lost a child. We've lost loved ones. Everybody on our groups have lost somebody somehow. And we lose ourselves sometimes and, and then are depressed and having hard times. And I always tell my kids, my seven kids and 31 grandbabies, I say painting's better than drugs. And they go, Mom, that sounds terrible. It's like you take drugs. And I said, the thing is, is there's so many side effects. Now, I think you might have a side of, of drugs, but sometimes you might have a side effect of getting too many painting supplies, I hear from some of my ladies. But um, I have to tell you, my world's been blessed during my hard times and my good times to um, have painting to, and being able to share with people. And the beauty that happened in my life is during COVID, I was able to find a world of painters that are wannabe painters. And we have grown. We just hit, guys, 146,000 subscribers. So I'm so thrilled and I'm so grateful. God has so blessed me. And I have so many friends around the world that I never had before. And I appreciate that. So I know I'm going to stop keeping you here. And, but I'm grateful that you stayed on and watched and hope you go look for more on my Donna Dewberry channel. Okay. Thank you guys.
See you. See you again soon. So when you subscribe, ring that bell. It'll tell you everywhere and every time I'm going to come on live when you weren't expecting it. Okay. And I will post this um, picture and you can go watch this over if you just saw bits of it. And I appreciate that. All right. That's so great. I'm happy for you. Thank you guys.